Hi students, in this program I am going to explain you how to use hierarchical inheritance in Java. Okay. So first of all I am creating a class name and I will use one method. I am defining one method here which just brings that it is a super class. Just let me write here super class E. Okay, for us to understand that this statement is from the method of super class E. Okay, now I am defining a class B extends E. That means B is subclass of And let me name it as a show A. Now let me differentiate the methods of other classes. Let me call it as B. And look here, it is a subclass. It is subclass of A. B is subclass of A here. Okay. Next, I am defining a class C extends E that is one super class many subclasses this concept is hierarchical inheritance C let, let me see how it is let me define it as C and let me call it as C and C is also subclass of E in the same way, if you want, you can declare and define a D also. But for all these super classes, so this type of inheritance comes under hierarchical inheritance. So let me here. Yeah. Okay. Now going to the actual method, actual program, public static hierarchical inheritance main method. Here I am declaring objects for these three subclasses. So what are they? B object one is equal to new B subclass one. First subclass. Next for C is equal to new new C. Next to D. So these are all subclasses of E. To new now you see by using these objects of subclasses let me call both the methods of its own and its super class also so object one dot I'll call method show I think it's a small letter yes no? show e okay so here you are calling super class method by using subclass of b I am calling here method which is defined in subclass b itself in the same way we will call methods of a super class using second subclass and the method of its own so let me do this for another object also here d is also subclass of e. let me see how the output will be i think you have understood here a is a super class. Let me call it as a A A B A A A C A A. I am just renaming them. Earlier I have used it. That's why I am 
giving some other names to this. Okay. So now let me execute and let's see. See here. Super class A, B is subclass of A. So B is subclass of A by using object of here sub B is subclass of A. C is subclass of A. D is subclass of A. By using objects of all these subclasses, you are calling its super class method and its own method. That's what happening here. Super class A, B is subclass of A. Super class A, C is subclass of A. Super class A, B is subclass of A. So it's able to call. So this type of inheritance where you have several subclasses for a single super class, you call it as hierarchical inheritance. Okay.